YouTP Web Tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install LibreOffice onto your Windows 10 computer. So to do this, we need to go to Google. So just go to Google and type in LibreOffice. Click on the link, and then click on Download, and then download LibreOffice. And we'll be installing the latest version. You can select the operating system. You've got Linux versions here, Mac versions here. Um, you may need to install the 64-bit version um, of uh, the software, depending on your operating system. More than likely, it'll be the 64-bit version. I'm going to click the download. And you can donate if you want to donate. We'll just wait for this to download. Just have to be a bit patient here. It's quite a large file, 233 megabytes. So it'll take a bit of time. Okay, once it's downloaded, you can launch the application. And my Norton's checked <coughs> and it's verified it's okay to install. So we click next, we want a typical installation, and we want to create a start link on our desktop. We may remove that afterwards. We don't really want to load the software during startup. We don't want that. I wouldn't advise to have that. So we click next, then we're just going to wait for this to install. You might not see this screen, but a pop-up display is asking me to confirm that I want to install the software. I've clicked yes and now it's proceeding to install. Okay, that's it, job done. You can click finish and you'll see the start option here. If I were to double click on that, then it's going to upload, it's, it's going to open up a LibreOffice start panel, and here you can get access to Writer, which is the equivalent of Microsoft Word. You've got Calc, which is like Excel. You've got Impress, which is presentations like Microsoft um, PowerPoint. You've got drawing or formulas and you've got a database here like access so you can access any of the applications if you were to click on calc for example just double click you can see it's very similar to microsoft excel and very similar to open office um, calc as well so that's how you go about installing LibreOffice onto your windows 10 computer and i'm going to follow this up with some tutorials on different applications within LibreOffice. If you've got a few minutes, you can go to my YouTube page. And when you go to youtube.com slash DCP Web Designers, click on the video section here. And you can find a tutorial I've made already for LibreOffice Calc. I'm going to do one for the text editor and a few other uh, tutorials as well, how to make charts and so forth. You can find a lot of tutorials in here on OpenOffice as well. LibreOffice and OpenOffice are very, very similar. 
so um, it's down to preference which one you install or you can install both of them okay if you want to install open office you can watch this tutorial here um, and I look forward to seeing you on the next tutorial